These niggas that y'all swear up and down, they better than us. We finna see, bro. Because I have not seen Michigan play at all. I'm really doing my homework. You know what I'm saying? Do your homework. To see if they really valid or talking about something. I might not be able to tell because Michigan State might just be sorry. But we finna see, bro. A lot of y'all telling me. I got hella bets on Ohio State versus Michigan this year. I really believe in this. Well, I always believe in this every year, but unfortunately they did beat us. That's a good hit. Unfortunately they did beat us last year. Um, but I think we're going to get them this year for sure. I have not seen Michigan play at all. Like, I have not seen shit from Michigan State. I mean Michigan. I seen like a couple, like, like a TikTok of they of their quarterback or some shit. And they were saying like they got a good defense. But other than that, I've not seen Michigan play. I ain't seen no highlights. I ain't seen nothing. Um, they playing Michigan State. They rival. They just down the street from them. Michigan State two and four. They not that good. So I can't I can't just sit here and say Michigan gonna give us problems. Look like they sending a little blitz. Look like they sending like a a patient blitz. So like if the linebacker don't see a check down, he'll just blitz. This one right here. Like I said, though, Michigan State, I mean, they probably not that good. Sometimes, some years they was good, though. They got some nice uniforms. And black helmets hard on every team, bro. If your team got a black helmet, that shit hard as hell. Nobody shit hard than Oregon shit, obviously, but them helmets hard. I know y'all see these curls, though. Like, it's the curls for me. You know what I'm saying? I'm really just waiting for the Michigan and uh, Notre Dame game. I mean, Penn State game. I don't think they play Notre Dame this year. We beat them. But, um, I don't think they play uh, Notre Dame this year. But they know, I know they play Penn State, and that'll really, that'll definitely tell me who, like, how good they is because Penn State not sorry. But I don't think, obviously, I think Michigan gonna beat them, but. If it's a, if if they if Michigan just go out there and just beat the fuck out of Penn State, I ain't gonna lie, we might be in trouble. We might be in trouble. I hate that this I hate that this nigga still coaching them, bro. Why don't you just like retire with uh with fucking Urban Meyer, bro. Bro, niggas, do, do your homework on Urban Meyer, bro. If we would have had Urban Meyer last year, we definitely would have not let Georgia come back, and we would have won the championship last year, and that's a fucking fact. Any nigga that's saying no, y'all are fucking crazy. We, would, we, we, we probably would have blew out Georgia last year, to be honest. And they definitely would have wouldn't have made no comeback. That's for sure. But Urban Meyer, do your homework on Urban Meyer versus this nigga right here, the Harbaugh, the Har, no, Jim, Jim Harbaugh, uh, or maybe just the other one, the other, whatever Harbaugh, the other one played for the uh, Coach the Ravens, or, I don't fucking know, but do your homework on them two battling it out every year, bro. Ohio State versus Michigan is easily the best uh, rivalry in sports, easily. I can't think of another one. Probably Golden State and Cavs. But they don't play each other no more. Like they these two teams gotta play each other. So like team wise, Michigan versus Ohio State is the biggest rivalry of all time. For sure. Alabama and Tennessee starting up starting up a little rivalry. I did watch that game. Um I ain't gonna watch the highlights for that game though. Unless y'all want me to. Shit. Everybody, that, that game was a little, that game was a couple days ago, though, so I probably won't react really to that. What happened to the sound?
Do your homework on Urban Meyer, bro. That's my dog, man. That's a good throw. That's a good throw in traffic. Let me see. It's a good fucking throw. You got the safety over the top. You put it right in the middle of three, one, two, three defenders. I like that. I like that for him. I, mean, I can tell you off the rip, Michigan probably has a better quarterback. Did this Michigan quarterback play last year? I don't even know. I don't. I really don't even remember. College would be switching quarterbacks so much. But if the, if the Michigan quarterback played last year, then obviously he has some uh, experience under his belt. So that, that would definitely give them a little edge in the quarterback position anyway. Like I was saying in Ohio State, real. Really, if you don't got no good tight end, you're going to struggle. And it seems like um, Michigan got some big receivers. I see number 18 and number 89 getting a lot of touches right here. And number one, he's a little smaller, but still. So it seems like Michigan uses their tight ends. And what the hell happened here? That, that pick looked too easy. Oh, the receiver, either he didn't run the right route or he just didn't know what the fuck when he was going to throw it. Cause I blame the quarterback for that one. He kind of rushed that throw, but he was going to get sacked, man. Michigan's defense not really showing me nothing. I mean, they're not really showing Michigan State on offense at all, so they must be getting stopped. But Michigan defense not really showing me nothing. Any 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 casual set cornerback would have got that interception. But uh, like I said earlier, they is sending like a little blitz almost every fucking time. Crazy though. Like I said, they use their tight ends. We have linebackers. We have good linebackers for that though. I can't even lie to you. Michigan suck. I mean, Michigan State, y'all, y'all trash. It, it's horrible. Horrible, horrible showcase. Good hit. Good hit. Bro, is it just me or sometimes do the rest be just throwing their flag only when like the crowd react? Like, I hate that shit. When the crowd be like, ooh, then they'll throw their flag. Like, I don't like that shit. Like I said, Michigan definitely getting back there. Hold on. The fuck? So they on one side of the football right here. I don't like this. I don't like this right here. How many people blitz? See, they confuse you. Look at number 26 right here. What was he lined up at? You don't know who the fuck my blitz. 
Where the fuck was he at? He just came out of nowhere. Is this him right there? Oh. And they got everything covered. Look at this. He finna probably get him. I don't know what. I don't know who. Or he. Or or he probably letting the safety pick up him. If it's somebody right here. It's probably somebody right here. He picking up. They damn near double team him. Uh, that shit clamp the fuck up. Unless this nigga. Unless it's nobody right here. But it's too late. By the time that happened, quarterback set. I could just tell you this right here, Michigan. Like, if you think it's gonna be this easy against us, like you're fucking crazy. Oh, Damn. I hate seeing people get injured though, cause like, it's like people get injured in football games every fucking time. Bro. I hate that shit. Yeah, what did happen? Oh. I thought number 10 had a ball. I like to see that, bro. Because he was supposed to score the first time, but. I mean, that blitz is kind of scaring me a little bit. Because I know how we handle blitzes. We don't handle them very well. Especially if uh, number six is uh, getting pressured. He doesn't handle that very well. I'm talking about Ohio State, by the way. Um, offensively, y'all, uh, I didn't really throw it to too many people. Y'all threw it to like two, three targets. I didn't really see y'all run the ball either that much. So, but that tight end shit, I ain't gonna lie, that shit not gonna happen. That shit ain't gonna happen like that. Unless y'all just unless y'all just run some play to just fucking confuse the fuck out of us and blow our heads up, I ain't gonna lie that tight end shit and him getting loose like that, man, that shit ain't gonna happen. I ain't gonna lie to you. Our, our, our linebackers and safeties are too good for that shit. I say this, y'all y'all quarterback might have some time in the pocket, but as far as you know, what I'm saying it's only gonna be so much time until you know, what I'm saying we get sacked because like. We really stick on our on our receivers and, and tight ends. Like that's what I will say about our defense. Um, I think it's gonna be a good one. I think it's gonna be a low scoring game this year between Ohio State and Michigan. I think Marvin Harris is gonna give you IL, but I mean, of course, that's the that's what everybody would think. Um, I don't know. I think, I think it can go either way, really. I really do, cause I know with that blitz, that bl y'all blitzing like that alone and kind of fucking up his head, and the way he gets kind of nervous and scared sometimes, I know that that will like fuck him up. Like that will fuck the whole our whole game plan up if y'all just getting stopped after stop, and especially if we have to come back. Like if we have to come back like fourteen to zero or something like that, like it just it probably just won't happen like that from what I see from us. Not saying I don't have faith in that, but I'm saying like that's just how we that's how that's what we showed this year. But we getting better. Um, Michigan plays Ohio State in the last game of the season, so that's in like six games. So we might figure it out before then. Cause I don't know, I ain't gonna lie, like the rest of our schedule until then is just easy at teams. But I mean, you know what I'm saying? Upsets happen every day. Uh, Michigan plays Penn State in a couple weeks, so I I definitely will be turning tuning into that game. But I ain't gonna hold y'all up too much, you know what I'm saying? This is Michigan versus Michigan State. Um, I'm probably gonna react to some NFL um, in a second. So, hope y'all enjoyed the video. Make sure y'all like, comment, subscribe, man. We out this thing.